Hey guys, another day at the shop. A little shop talk here. We got in an ATM 50A1 City Rider from Town Motors. And we got Kyle here today and Adam. They're doing the uh, PDI. Again, we got two people, two guys, uh, experienced techs tackling this. So when you're experienced, it should only take you about uh, 45 minutes to an hour to set this up. If you're not, then you're looking at probably about two to three hours which will include from start to finish, you know, testing and uh, tuning it. They all have to be tuned up properly too. And they always get tuned up properly here before we roll them out in the showroom and put a for sale sign on them. Okay, this is the uh, popular Tau Motor ATM 50A1 City Rider moped gas scooter. This vehicle gets registered in the state of Nevada as a moped. It's a 1.8, 1.9 brake horsepower. In the state of Nevada, there's a one-time registration. You need a standard driver's license. Currently, there's no insurance requirements, but you do have to wear a helmet. So they changed that law back uh, in October of uh, 2019. Again, this uh, was in a fully boxed crate. And as you can see, it only has its base available right now. They're going to roll it off that crate once they put the uh, front wheel on it. So we always inspect for damage. They do arrive damaged at times, and that's due to freight and uh, forklift damage. And if it is, then of course that's something we have to tend to and make sure that we get the required replacement parts from Tile Motors before we roll it out to the showroom and make it available for the customer. When you do order online, when you're out of the area, this is something you would have to tend to from the uh, online dealer you purchased it from. So if it did arrive damaged, again, there will be some downtime and it does happen at times. Again, you're responsible to set it up properly. Either hire an experienced mechanic or somebody that understands how to work with tools and is a bit mechanical because there are no instructions included in the box on how to set these up. It's all done based on uh, experience. So always keep that in mind when you're ordering anything online, whether it be a go-kart, scooter, dune buggy, a lot of the dune buggies now, the much, much larger ones, side by sides up to 800 cc, they do, they do uh, arrive fully assembled and PDI'd. So they no longer, there were too many problems uh, shipping them crated. So the manufacturers got wise and figured out how to have these larger vehicles shipped to customers all around the country fully assembled they're typically shipped on car carriers but the smaller vehicles are definitely shipped crated again whether it be a dirt bike go-kart or scooter when it's shipped directly to your place of business or your home there is assembly required again instructions are not included on any assembly so keep that in mind when you're ordering anything online and they are problems it's not as easy as a lot of these online dealers make it seem when you're shopping on uh, their websites uh, we ship as well out of the area we make that clear to all our customers so they understand what they're getting into again it can be done but then again it has to be done properly when it's done properly you'll be definitely happy with the product because they're excellent products as long as they're assembled and PDI properly, as well as you follow all the recommended maintenance on the vehicles. So this uh, just got done. Came in for service and 10 hour service actually was purchased uh, during the holidays. And obviously the kids have been having a lot of fun with this Jeep Auto. This is the Jeep Auto from Tao Motors. And yeah, I mean, we had to completely go through it and retighten everything. Of course, replace all the 
the oils, the fluids, as well as the uh, spark plug, fuel filter, tighten all the nuts and bolts. We do, we do also remove all the wheels, we tighten all the hubs, re-grease the splines, tighten the chain, readjust the chain. So this puppy is uh, ready to be picked up. It just got done today. Again, it's part of the 10 hour service. Looks like this one, uh, customer said the kids uh, did something to it. So it's missing one of the top lights over here. So other than that, it's uh, still it's running great. But uh, yeah, looks like they've been having a lot of fun with it. So, take a walk into the showroom. All right. you guys a glimpse of our current inventory Push this puppy back here. GK110, X4, and the, uh, here's another Jeep Auto. This is the tree camel style. All right, guys, wrapping it up. ScooterATVSales.com. Smash that like button. Subscribe. Check us out online. ScooterATVSales.com. Order your ATV scooters. And go-karts and doom buggies. Any questions, give us a call. 775-856-3398. Hey, guys. We did a review on the GK110 Pony Kids Off-Road Go-Kart by Tao Motors. But we did not have a chance to uh, give it a test drive. So today we're going to give it a test drive. But I'm going to do a quick review anyways again on uh, the GK110 Pony Kids Off-Road Go-Kart. Do a little walk around here so you can get a view, different angles of the GK110 Pony Kids Go Kart. The seat is a bench seat. It does adjust approximately up to six inches forward. It is pushed back all the way. You do have functional headlights in the front. The shocks all the way around do include uh, dampeners. Just the uh, ride. It does have a manual choke on it as well on the right uh, side of the carburetor for cold starts. The gas tank here on top it does include a metal gas cap of a rear rack so kids can tie their belongings onto it. Heavy duty swing arm in the back, dual shocks, a 110cc direct drive chain driven. What's cool about the uh, pedals for the kids, for the brake you do have uh, the stop as well as you have uh, go for the gas pedal. Hydraulic brakes all the way around discs. This is uh, an e-brake feature here. Parking brake. This is the shifter. It is a fully automatic. So forward would be into drive and then Pulling it backwards would be for reverse. There's the adjuster for the seat on the uh, left side. Good harnesses, keep the kids in. Comes uh, with the canopy top here, protect you from the sun. So this is a real nice beginner's go-kart. Does have rack and pinion steering. So 
so it's super easy to ride and steer. Indicator light showing whether you are in. Get a better view of that. Drive or reverse or neutral position. This is a horn that's included on that. High beam, low beam on and off switches. This is the uh, ignition switch to turn on the go kart. So it's a really nice overall go kart for kids. It's a four stroke engine. Nice top rack on there, padded all the way around. So we're going to give it a test drive, hop in that car. Show our subscribers, customers, uh, how it rides. Kyle's about five foot two, so maybe pushing five three. This give you an idea of what size rider would fit in the go-kart as you notice it's very quiet so you won't be waking your or bothering your neighbors again it's an off-road go-kart the chassis system rear axle is designed for the dirt Okay, this is the GK110 Pony by Tau Motors, beginner kids go-kart. You can check this out on our website on scooteratbsales.com. I'm going to place a link below with the details. So you guys can click the link and get right to this go-kart, get some details or to order one. Again, when you do order online, you're out of the area, these do come in a crate and assembly is required. It takes approximately three to four hours to fully assemble PDI this vehicle properly tested and tune it. Or just stop by if you're in the area in Reno, Nevada, stop by the store. We don't have a color of your choice and we can order you one. They take about a week. And we fully PDI as well as uh, when you pick it up, there is a small short orientation. And off you go, it's turnkey, ready to ride. With a free extended warranty. Again, the Tau Motor GK110 Pony Kids Off Road Go Kart. See you guys soon. Hey guys, welcome back. ScooterATVSales.com, Scooter City ATV8, ATV Outlet in Reno, Nevada. We're going to do a little up close on the popular kids Tau GK 110 pony go-kart it is fully automatic with reverse and forward gear has a neutral position has an e-brake has all functioning lights on there the front headlights do function on the go-kart just give you a quick tour around the vehicle definitely very high quality for the price it has a Honda Clone 110 cc motor on it with a solid rear axle. It is chain driven. It has dual shocks in the back and they have dampeners on them as you can see the uh, dampeners on there. Both sides here. This is the rear rack where kids can store items on or take uh, their stuff with them. It's the gas tank. It does have a nice roll bar around there, padded. It's nicely padded all the way around. It does have a top here to protect from the sun. Rack and pinion steering. This is a really nice go-kart for kids. I wish uh, we had things like this when we were growing up. So uh, Adam's here. We're gonna give it a start. Now this vehicle does come with a remote start and kill fob as you can see this is the fob in his hand that is a remote system it also has a gas pedal stopper or adjuster so you can adjust it on the gas pedal here there's a little nut as shown here that can be adjusted adjust the travel of the gas pedal so Adam's gonna give it a start so you can hear it run super quiet
does have a manual choke system on the carburetor. on the uh, panel right now. So we're going to start from this angle right here. Go ahead, Adam. Okay, so you got your on-off switch for all your lights. Okay, right now they should be on. And this is just a dummy switch. It doesn't do anything. You also have a horn right here. Makes it very simple. Now to start it, basically you just twist it like a car and it should just start right up. Now you got a neutral light indicator which will tell you if it's in drive, neutral or reverse. So forward drive, neutral, and reverse. And then back to neutral and stop. You got your gas pedal here and your brake pedal here. And then obviously your e-brake. What was that e-brake again there? I don't want to show that e-brake one more time. Right here. That is the e-brake on the go car. Okay. So and the, the lights are on, correct? Mm -hmm. Let's show the everyone where the light the lights look like. The lights are on. Again, it does have a remote fob, so Adam's gonna demonstrate how that works. That's in his hand. So basically to shut the vehicle off, you hit the unlock button. Now just in case if somebody was to actually go and steal the thing, which they probably won't. But it's got the remote shut off and the alarm. Awesome. And then obviously features. the remote start. And then just in case if you want your kids, this goes up to 200 feet. Cut, you want your kids to come in, and I'll give them the warning to come in. All right, and the seat does adjust too, Adam, right? Yep, exactly. So right here, there's a little lever that you pull up, and then It'll go forward, which is all the way forward, and then you push it back, which, just like that. As soon so it as they adjusts up in. to about what six inches, correct? Right. All right, and then uh, this is a bench seat. Uh, we do have some excellent harnesses on there too. Show, uh, show everyone the harnesses. So, just a simple seat belt. Just click it, and you go. Okay. Excellent. Loaded with safety features. Loaded with quality. Again, it has that uh, remote fob. This is the Tau GK 110 Pony Kids Go Kart, fully automatic, four stroke. Right now, we have a sale going on, $13.95 for the go kart, plus tax, and there is a DMV title on it. So come down and check us out. Again, 920 Matthew Lane in Reno. Suite 6 or number 6, number here is 775-856-3398. If you're out of the area, you can shop online at scooteratvsales.com. There is free shipping to most locations, but the go-kart will arrive in a box. And that will arrive in a crated box where there will be PDI assembly required. So it does take some skill to PDI these and set them up. Again, stop by our store. This one's ready to go, looking for a new home. And uh, we'll see you guys soon. Thank you.